Kwanza hapa sisi juu hata mamake anakaa wapi yes. hata sijipe nye mtu huyu hapo. So sasa hapa kwa hii conversation yako na Jaden amekuwa umemwambia let meet akasema sawa. I think mulipatana because conversation ikiendelea hapa mbele ana, unamwambia and take care of Kiki nitarudi jioni kabisa. So akakwambia it's okay alafu akakutumia la emoji na akakwambia don't forget our plan na usimuonyeshe umetense ukienda kwake. Ju atajua ni kama tume plan. So wewe na Jaden are you guys in a relationship na mtoto wako ako, ako na Jaden? Uzi amesema Kiki yako kwa mama yake. Si umesema Kiki yako kwa mama yako? Kiki yako safe. Kwa hiyo namata kwenye yako. Hata umso labda ni wa Jaden. Hebu tusi tusi tusiweke vitu zenye hazi huko. Na wanga ni willing nikasema I can sacrifice for that DNA test because from the beginning lalikuwa na sound nilisuspect hata mtu hawezi kuwa huyu. So, mtu anaweza kuwa Jaden. Hello Angel, some Angel Wanjiku and I'm here with my producer Collins Angels who are on road to a million subscribers. Let's keep on subscribing so that we can get there and of course welcome back to the reunion show to Najua what goes down down here mambo ni live live kwa ground and of course leo tuko kwa ground na niko kwa nyumba ya Jesse na mke wake Carol katasi of Lillian Lillian approached me and you told me we are coming to see the father of your kid the man that you you have been with for a very long time na ndo hapa sisi tumekuja but what i didn't know is that wewe haumjonana na yeye for over four years and it's because ali toroka na mtoto akakuacha hivyo na you moved on you have a wife na mnaendelea na maisha yenu vizuri si ndio yeah. yeah okay so sasa i wanted us to discuss about your relationship you guys before before muachane si ndio because Lilian according to what i understand una feel hurt ajakuwa akiprovidea familia ajakuwa akiprovidea mtoto si ndio si eh na sasa hizi akona pesa eh Mbona ulituacha shuali? Na hata uwezi kututafuta. Sasa tuanze pole pole. Niambie wewe, ni mkiwa kwa hiyo relationship yenu mambo ilikuwaaje? Tulikuwa tuna struggle. Hakuwa na ile stable job. Alikuwa anafanya hizi job za ile ya kuitwa e, kuja kuna kazi nini nini. Mm. But most of the time nilikuwa na provide. Wewe ulikuwa na kazi? Eh nilikuwa na kazi. Mm-hmm. So ile time sika fika nikamboa kuna job ingine. You have to travel niende western siko na jua nitakaa sana saa kurudi nikapata huyu jamaa shaenda so venye alienda western alikwambia amepata job nyingine anateremka huko western sasa yeye anasema hapa reason ya kwenda ni kwa sababu alipata job nyingine western huyu mm. dem ni hypocrite sana hakuna kitu kama hiyo mm-hmm. yeye alienda na issues zake mm-hmm. she know anajua kwa anajua kwa nini alienda mm-hmm. kwa sababu but hiyo within that period of two years yeye tulikuwa tuna, tunaishi na yeye ilikuwa ngatu ya ups and downs yeye alianza ku react different kabisa because alianza kunibeba ufala naweza sema hivyo mm. alianza kuna ni kama because ana chip in kwa some some, some things mm. si ati kama nilikuwa na cut tu ku chip in kwa some things what do you mean as in mina mina believe kwa marriage kama mnaishi pamoja mnafahamu saidiane si kama maisha ya kitambo ati responsibility ni ya mwanaume pekee yake ku provide na si ati nasema anafa provide kila kitu at that time si kwa na job stable vile anasema ili kwa tu ya kuitiwa itiwa hivyo 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 so nikikosa kitu yeye yeah, alikuwa na job alikuwa ana chipi na maybe ana buy food vitu kama hizo mm. maybe anaongezea do ya rent nini kitu kama hiyo na mimi nilikuwa na feel pain by the way kaa kifanya vitu kama hizo because i know na fund provide but nilikuwa najikaza vile naweza so ikafika mahali akaanza kunionyesha madharao because alikuwa na ah ni kama ananilea kitu kama hiyo nini vitu kama hizo anaanza kunibeba ufala yani anatoka asubuhi ndiye ameenda job ana mimi na, na expect ana farudi maybe kitu kama 4 ama 5 hapo hivyo but unapata ameke ameka baka saa sasa unashangaa ameenda ameenda sanga baka kuna siku yenye alikaba ali, alirudi the next day Kuna nafanya hivyo kwa relationship yako the next day jioni uh-huh. eh nikashangaa unajaribu kumpigia yana hata ashiki simu unashangaa shida ni gani so eh things started being difficult in your relationship eh ikaanza kuwa difficult nikaanza kushangaa eh kubona udema maanza ku behave hivyo because at that people nilisema tu mwanzo mwanzo the six months ilikuwa poor we, we were good lakini vile alianza alipata job akaanza kupata pesa zake akaanza kuna ni kama yende anaprovide kila kitu akaanza ku change so, eh, feel kama yende anafaa ku provide hata kama hana kazi na hana pesa obviously hiyo ndio kazi ya mwanaume kwani kazi ya mwanaume ni nini hmm. ku provide kupe rent hata hata uko na shukurani hata hmm. kuna siku jeni niambia asante nimelipa nime rent ujawai 
issue ni we ulikuwa unaenda wapi so bono uli change to evil all of a sudden si hata kama unataka kuachana na mtu bono umeonesha madharau so ne unamwambia acha ishi hapa hivi na unaenda ka nilikuwa nienda ningekuacha kitambo <laughs> nilikuwa imagine unalipa rent almost an year huyu ataj ni mara ngapi ume provide rent hizo hizo siku zote hivyo hata ulikuwa ushailipa rent nini mwezi mzima unalipa pesa yote mbona nadanganya ude hakuna siku nyameshailipa do yote ati vile anasema hivyo hakuna maybe ni ile tu vile maybe sasa hiyo nilikuwa naishi nyumba ya single kwanza ilikuwa bed sitter ilikuwa ni ilikuwa bed sitter sasa ilikuwa inachezea kitu kama 5000 maybe nimekosa 1000 shillings na mwambia because eh, jaribu uchipin niongezee tao moja alafu nda ku refund kitu kama hiyo si hata namwambia lipe rent hiyo ni i know mama nafani provide so sisi ya kuachia burden yote bonu unaanza kusema vitu vingine hapa hivi do you want us to feel sympathy for you Sao unasema kwa, nini hizo sasa kuongezea 1000 kwa rent hiyo ni kulipa rent then you buy food hata ngoo nilikuwa na kubayona mmesao hivyo usiongee ujinga madam kulikuwa na baya nani nguo mimi na struggle luko nje na tafuta kila kitu hata siezi siezi hata siko anavaa siko kila kitu inaishia kwa nyumba hapo hivyo hata siko anajinulia nguo alafu unasema wewe pesa zako ulikuwa unapeleka wapi kama sio kuchip kidogo tu hivyo hizo zingine ulikuwa unapeleka wapi kulipa rent na ku buy food hiyo ni kuchip kidogo sasa issue So unasema yeye yeah, yeah, she's ungrateful na wewe unasema you are providing like you are the man of that house. Yes I was. Kitu iliwafanya mu separate. Eh. Junilia. Mu separate hiyo. Step up for the baby. Bonu, Kwanza bon, Kenya nataka Kenya nataka kuuliza bona huku niacha vile huku ana huku ana ball huku ana mtu. Bona tu li choose ukapata mtu hii ndio ukaenda. Eh? Huku unajua unaacha 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 gap nyingine. Nzuri na singewaacha. So imagine ingekaa hapo hiyo time tu tuangua ngekaa. Story na hiyo story ya kwenda siji western nini nini. Hata mm. hakuna an, background na mlead baka western. Hakuna. Kwani ali ulipata na nani akakupeleka western? So alikuwa wapi hizo miaka so, zote? Sijui I don't know because hajaacha clue yoyote, hakuacha kitu yote. So communication yenu iliisha aje aliku block ama ali change number. The nakumbuka kwanza siku vizuri nilikuja tu nime nimeenda kazi kazi zangu nini nimeitiwa itwa hizo ma squad ama nini hizo ni kurudi jioni eh <laughs> yani napata na, napata hakuna msi na vitu kwa nyumba zilikuwa mali na zilikuwa because hata zilikuwa vitu za domob nini okay. vitu kama hizo vitu zilikuwa kwa nyumba uh-huh. lakini hakuna mtu nikaona eh maybe ameenda mahali uh-huh. wacha ni ngoja kiasi uh-huh. saa moja, saa mbili, saa tatu. Uh-huh. na sasa hiyo by the alikuwa na mtu hii na shanga wewe huu mada huu mdema ameenda wapi na mtu na mtu na mtu yako wapi Najaribu kumpigia shiki, najaribu kumpigia shiki, najaribu kumpigia shiki. Eh. Siku nyingine nikampigia, akaniambia we achana na mimi, endelea na maisha yako. Hivyo ndo alisema ali, ali, nika siku nyingine alishika phone akaniambia hivyo. Uh-huh. Eh nikajarudia nika nikajaribu hata kumuongelesha akakata phone kabisa. Uh-huh. The next day nika sasa mimi because of the child niko naacha niendelea kufuatilia. Najaribu kumpigia wapi? Najaribu kumpigia wapi? Uh-huh. Baka ikafika mahali uh-huh. aka change namba kabisa sasa. Yaani uwezi mpata totally na mimi sikuwa na vile naweza mu approach sikuwa na jobu naweza 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 trace hata maybe ni kama niko na jua mama yake sister zake ama nini sikuwa na jua watu wote kwao yani sikuwa na jua mtu yote so, yeah. so nikashindwa ndaanzia wapi okay. nilikwambia ni vile vile nilianza niliwaambia nilienda bao kwa police station nikajaribu kuripot kwa kinyo akasema yeye ni mama ya mtoto wako na right yote yako kana mtu hii nini na nini na nini mm. but nikawa na sasa because ya mama hivyo mm. well and good hata kama ile new money sa ni sawa. So sasa nikuuliza Lilian, wewe kwani you found another man? Mwenye ukaenda ukaanza kuishi na yeye ama what happened? What happened? Ile kazi nilikuwa nafanya, mm. nikaambua there is a good opportunity. <laughs> Tulikuwa najua Kenya nafanya, ni unajifanya, nikaambua kuna opportunity mzuri iko Western. Nikaambua hata ikae sana itako. Western, Western, Western. Si useme tu kweli wewe umekuwa. Sio kwa nimalize. Ngalia huyu nikaambiwa kuna ana good opportunity but haitaka mm-hmm. ni before ni ni itakuwa 2 months then nirudi mm-hmm. sasa kwenda huko ni ikaka like ikabidi ika nikae huko for for long mm-hmm. sasa after imeisha nikarudi nika come back after mm-hmm. one year nika after kwenda ku, kwa nyumba nikapata hakuna mtu nikapata amehama ashahama bona aliniambia ni achane na yeye niendelee na maisha yangu so wewe ulimtext ukamwambia achane na wewe aendelee na maisha yake hautaki story zake utachunga mtoto wako did you tell him all those things before umuache i have to move on but i have to come back because of the baby 
So umesema you had to move on. Si juu ya mtoi. Uliko move on mpaka na mtoi. Bwana wasa uliko nakuja kunitafuta nini? Who is supposed to kill the baby? Nilikuwa nimerudi juu ya mtoto. Si hata juu. Sasa juu ulienda ukajikalisha hizo miaka 4 na you were taking care of your baby and understand mtoto sahihi ni mkubwa ndo anaanza kwenda shule, si ndio? So umekuwa ukichunga mtoto wako, si ndio? Yeah. So sasa hizi imekuwa so difficult for you kumlea ndo maana umerudi? Mm. Nini imekuleta sasa? Kwani kazi yako ni gani? You're supposed to take care of your kid. Hiyo hiyo period ya 3 years, au uko unajua kazi yangu ni gani? Bono kumleta hiyo saa yote, hiyo saa hii ndio unakuja kumleta. Unge provide kweli? Unajua you know, nimetoka wapi wewe msichana wewe? <laughs> so you, that all that your time unge provide. Hmm. Was there... was ready nilikuwa ready kufanya kila kitu mtu huyo apate life fit well, nilikuwa was ready kabisa that time mlikuwa mnapendana ulikuwa unampenda yeah mimi nilikuwa nimependa huu dem uh. nilikuwa nimempenda vizuri kabisa yani nilikuwa nimeamua kama ni yeye ni yeye yeah. lakini yeye hakuwa anaona hivyo wewe well, ulikuwa unampenda at some point nilikuwa nimependa mm. yeah, at, at some point, point. Okay na was there an issue of infidelity between you ama ilikuwa tu hizo issues za pesa? Ndio mimi nashangaa mm. hiyo time yenye alikuwa ngabala kuje home hiyo hiyo mat, masaa yote mm. alikuwa anaenda wapi? Hizo well. ma, mausiku hizo hizo ma, ma, mausiku alikuwa anaenda wapi? Ningeenda kufanya kazi have to impress my your boss. What what work are you doing? Impress this boss wako baka baka usiku si ndio? What work are you doing? Ilikuwa kazi ya online. Ilikuwa kazi ya online eh, na unatoka ya, kwa ya kuuza vitu online. Oh okay. Mm. Saa sa, kuna time tungekaa hadi usiku kabisa. Mm. And sometimes tunaweza nini like inaweza hadi saa tatu. Uongo. Bona hata uweze shika simu wambie mtu mimi sikuji ama Si, kweli unasikia wapi? Make sense. Hizo nini unaniambia? Mimi nimevumilia na u demo time yote. The word go. Hajai kukutrust. Eh haja why? Sasa mimi anza trust issues tena. Karo kwa nini umanyamaza? Me to be honest guy me he conversation like nimeshindwa ku understand kabisa like mm. gara sijui nani anasema ukweli so mm-hmm. nimefika na sikia nika niko na headache mm. um, mwanamke penye ametokea harudi tu penye ametoka mimi ara sina otherwise Zero harudi tu penye ametoka lazima take care of the kid ah, relax nimekulu mwana kweli kanaongea nime relax wewe pia kama unaongea ongea in a good way mm. sawa so, respect me i respect you no, uh, si ongea in a good way lazima achunge mtoto wako wewe umesema mtoto saizi yako na wazazi wako si ndio uh. so ana w- wanamchunga vizuri wako na pesa wanamlea vizuri ama anateseka and that's why you need the help of the father uh, tuna tuna tunajaribu mm. that's why i need i need to do anything i can do for my kid mm. so, so you want your kid to come back and live with you here yeah together hmm? narudi huko <laughs> narudi huko ni kwangu pia mimi <laughs> why tu unataka kurudi hapa kwa <laughs> Jesse <laughs> ama unataka achunge mtoto wake i'm not joking lazima achunge mtoto wake na lazima mtoto akae na mimi okay. the only thing i can do ni ku provide kwa mtoi na kwanza mtoi mimi nataka kujaishi na mimi hapa lakini not you wewe mimi story zako mimi sitaki mimi ni mama yake have to send the other baby lazima nikae karibu na mtoto <laughs> What if the mother is irresponsible if you can't take good care of your All those years nimekaa na yeye na nimemchunga What has changed? Sasa sikiza ni mama kwa ameishi kwa na mtoto. Unaona si wewe. Si eti tsai yako kwa mama yake ameishi na mama yake. Like as for the moment ako na mom. But kuna for the long time nimekuwa na yeye. So sasa hizi tu ndio ako na mama yako. Eh design to trust. Sasa let me ask you something Karo because your man Jesse here he is saying anataka huyo Kiki anaitwa Kiki, yeah. ndio? Yeah. Anataka Kiki akuje akae hapa na nyinyi and this is something that you are finding out right now ako na mtoto. Are you comfortable with that and are you okay with that girl akikuja akae hapa aishi na nyinyi? Wewe umle kama Mtoto mzazi wangu so hata yeye anafana accept. Mtoi nani wangu? Yeah. Hivi yeah. ndio kishima li pengine. Accept. Busikiza kwanza my opinion. Unaona? Mm-hmm. At least first unafu ni pay time nifikirie kwanza because ni kitu mmenishtua. Ah, sikiza. I know she's your daughter. Sawa. <laughs> But nataka pia mimi at least unipe chance even if it means a week or two unaona because hata mimi sifurahii conversation yenu and mimi personally naweza nikataka mtoto by the way akuje hapa hivi so that communication yako na, ya, na wewe iishe hivyo because the moment anaishi na mtoto you people mtakuwa mna communicate ndio ni kitu staki so, utakuwa yeah. una create issues or oh, so you want to go and see your baby mama because you want to see your daughter and all that unaona so hizo is, issues zote si ati huyu akuje ishi kwa nyumba hiyo so, ni kitu moja can't accept anakuja kuishi kwa nyumba yangu kama nani kwani uko married to him no so, and no, kama wata, unaona kama watarudiana it. it's obvious nah. kama mtu ako na mtoto wako uh-huh. chances are hai wana zarudiana unaona so the best thing cut the communication uh-huh. trust me i'll take good care of your daughter and unaona do you think 
That is why huyu anataka kurudi hapa because anataka arudiane na bwana yako. Huyu msichana vile anaongea mm. si hata ni bwana anamtaka. Mm. Vile tu niliwaambia alia this girl like very materialistic. Okay. Unaona alitoka when the guy does not have money. How comes ana rudi when there is money? That means anajua what he wants from him. I'm sure haumpendi. I'm sure this is not love because uwezi acha mtu mwenye unampenda na mtu mwenye unampenda uwezi ukamdeny rights yako na mtoto wake. Unaona? So the first thing they just give me one week mm. i decide mtoto akuje mm. because zili pia huyu mwanamke renta ma akuje shina mimi kwa nyumba moja that's very impossible na mtoto aise kabira mimi okay sija kudina kwa moja sija kudina rate yako na mtoto wako unaona mtoto wako anaweza kuja kumuona kwa nyumba yangu unaona but si si mtoto kuishi na wewe because yeye atakuwa anashinda na me communication kama unaenda na mtoto then forget about him taking care of your daughter Uishi na mtoto na usishughulikiwe ama akae hapa hivi na uko allowed kukuja kumuona anytime you want to. Sika, nataka I take care of the kid. Na hivi siwezi kupea mtoto wangu ishi na yeye. Bwana ishi na yeye. Kwani mtoto ni wako? Mtoto ni wangu. Ni me struggle na yeye. Wait, ni marriage yangu I'm trying to secure. Wewe uliishi na yeye, you are not good enough to fight for your man. I'm here. I'm ready to fight for him. Unaona? Responsibility ya kulea mtoto imemshinda. Eh, hey, kama uzi fight mtoto wako and for peace to reign, bring the kid here. I'm very much willing. I'll do anything for but that kid. Na Unaona? Na but uyu. wewe kukuja kuishi kwa hii nyumba that's unacceptable. Mark my words by the very unacceptable. So, Wezi shia hapa. Okay. Lilian, are you getting what she is saying? Anataka achukue mtoto wako waishi na yeye kwa hii nyumba. Are you willing to do that for your kid? Ndio asaidiwe na baba yake. I'm his ni, mi ni mama yake. Mm. I'm supposed to be there for my for Asa my for my baby. Shot. You provide for your baby, mm. your kid. Me hata stoki story ya hii marriage. Ni mata I don't care. Okay, then there's an option here. Iko hivi. The kid, I'm sure ako 4 5 years, right? Yes. Kama ni shule ndio anataka kwanza. Hata mimi si mjisi hata sijui kama ameanza shule ama hajaanza bado hujatuambia. So kama ni school fees, skiza kama ni school fees, unaweza mpea details account ya shule kama ni school fees analipa direct if it's the clothes anaweza buy atume so but not you. sending the money direct in your account so for you you don't want any communication so between the two of them kama ni school fees apene account mm-hmm. account number kama ni anything inaenda direct you know i see si kubali na hiyo nini siwezi provide ya mtoto mwenye mimi si muone i fanyaje wewe basi pia wewe sasa pia uko realistic sasa si huyu atakai mtoto akae so unataka to for the past three years in, the, in my child's life so i need to be there na lazima ni kuko life yao mtoto I don't care kama ataishi mali pengine ama ataishi na mimi but I need to be in that child's life. So for you you're not agreeing with your wife akisema you cut communication na mama ya mtoto? Kama huyu anaishi nje itabidi nene nione mtoto mimi. And that is what I can't agree. Unaenda kwake kuona mtoto kama nani? Hiyo ni utaagree. There's no other option. Okay. Kama ni hivyo then me and you we are done. Sisi that you choose me ama you choose because uh, uh, to be honest utaki kunisikiza unaona mm-hmm. huu ni mtoto wako that's your blood of which i respect unaona so nimejaribu kukuwa realistic no alete mtoto this is not up here hakuna kitu kama hiyo hapa relax kwanza mpaka lini ukienda kuna mtoto kwa hiyo nyumba In fact that environment haita kwa conducive because from her character past character yake hujui kama ame change unaona first huyo mtoto kwa hiyo nyumba it's not secure for the kid the environment itself seems really kwa mtoto of which that kid is very young kama hata kana sisi then we am done with you <laughs> so karo unataka kuacha marriage yako kama ata, atakuwa anaenda huko nje kuona mtoto kwa mama yake obvious mimi nitamwacha because i don't believe mm. Missy G, but these people one is a rudiana. That is what I'm trying to. Ladies on an stress up sana hapa okay. hivi because hapa kuna issues mbili zenye. Huyu huyu hataki nienda nikaone mtoto. Huyu mm. hataki mtoto akuja kaa hapa hivi. So as a man what can you do about it? Eh? This woman here are very manipulative. Mm. Sijui kama nyinyi mnaona na mimi. Okay. This woman Z anaenda huko hivyo. Hata anaweza mfanya anything. Unaona? Na hizo ndio drama stacky. Mm. Stacky another drama after this. Unaona? Mm. So akaenda huko hivyo. She might even end up dragging him and they even get the second child. Na mistake hizo drama zote. Okay, siko ubaya, but stacky hizo drama zote. Unaona? Mm. So the best thing ni hivyo. Mtoto akuje aishi na mimi ama we are done. So, so it's it? either you choose. Na najua it's a hard decision to choose between your daughter mm. na mimi. But think wisely. So you for you you you, you don't trust your man hamna ile trust and security in your relationship. Oh, yes. To me she kukua with a lot and a lot of issues. Mm. A lot of issues zimeishi kukua kwa hii relationship. But hiyo haimaanisha sasa you cannot trust him sindao? 
Of course I don't trust him. I eh? don't trust him. Trust him. Ni ni nakufanya usi ni trust. Trust. Of let to me. No. Of let skiza. Unasikiza? <laughs> it seems ni habit. Mm. Imekuwa ndani yako. Ameishi kuni promise is going to change is going to change but a change. The first thing he claims like he gives me everything. Bana nataka ujue kitu moja. This man here does not allow me to work. Na niko na my degree. Unaona? So but you told me your parents wanted you to work because to work. Okay. So si unaona? Mm. So I had to leave some things uh-huh. juu na mpenda. So saizi wewe you are not working, you are staying at home. Okay, I can yes I'm working mm-hmm. but unajua kuna ile dedication. Yes to your job mm. unaona mm. but sina ile dedication sometimes unapata call from work but i can't do i can't go so juu so nini so uh, i'm talking unatafuta job so u provide ye nani uh, unataka uh, job unata una, yani unafanya job u provide ye nani wewe mwenyewe una mtoto uh, uh, sasa imeanza kukua tena ku uh, uh, una mtoto wewe unatafuta na umesikia sita kwa na mtoto ipo senye niko nayo hii kutoshi unatafuta wewe mwenyewe una mtoto unasema ti we need to project to moja wewe ni hata it makes sense pesa yako unataka kupeleka wapi i'm not the last born in our family unaona my parents wali nisomeshwa so that ni wasaidi in their old age wewe kama utaki saidi ni invest utaki ni saidi siblings wangu at the same time utaki ni work your pesa isaidie my family at the same time utaki ku take care of my family then you claim my family is your family who does that so he doesn't take, he doesn't care, doesn't of your take care of my family but okay. he takes care of me na kama anataka ku take care of me for me to be safe lazima take care of the family right. he does not give me the money to take care of my parents and my siblings na bado hataki ufanye kazi work vizuri so that i can take good care of them so niambie what kind of a man so sasa yeah. Jesse, let us let us, let us go to issue. let us talk about that because uh, kwa nini hautaki yeye afanye kazi is it that just because hana mtoto ama you have your your other reasons juu kama hiyo pesa yeah, anafanya kwanza amesema ni trust na mimi mwenyewe nime nime build trust yani mimi mwenyewe namfanyia kila kitu i don't cheat i don't do anything mimi nikienda club yangu mimi nana nakunywa pale hivi na mabeste zangu mm. na narudi home hakuna comp- kitu kama hiyo ati ati naanza kucheat ama nini vitu kama hizo because i believe mimi na yeye yani ni tunafuata kwa kitu moja unaona mm. so hakuna haja niende nje nje naanza kuhanya hanya ama vitu kama hizo because i, mm. I love unaona mm. So mimi nikisikia anasema she don't trust me baka na shangaa ai azinaje kila kitu unaona mm. eh yeah, inanishangaza sana mimi mm. Mm. na kwa nini hautaki afanye kazi Anafanya kazi juu ya nini because me provide. provide ya familia yake because you anasema you don't provide for her family pesa na mwachi hapa mingi anaweza manage baka provide ya family yake i do yeah. give her a lot of money baka nimemfungulia personal account na mwekenga pesa yake personal account na per month kwa personal account unaeka 10k sasa so, 10k ni kitu ya kusema mbele ya watu surely 10k surely pia unasema huu ni materialistic pia wewe maybe unafanya jichunguzi ah sikiza me want to work nani utaki kuni allow ni work unaona and huu unasema So for you you are not fulfilled if you are not working. Eh, hey, me want to work because I know my parents they have really spent a lot. So I really want. Alafu ni it's my career ni passion niko nayo, unaona? Reason yako kusema uni trust ni gani? Okay. I've been keeping this for long, but it's not like I kept it for long sana. Nili like I wanted for the right time because si kukuwa na full evidence. Let me show you something. Mimi nini ukisema full evidence? Just relax, let me show you something. I have something in my phone. So you're to nonga lela kuhusu you not trusting him. Eh si ameuliza like mbona si mtrust mm. and you don't which... so you, you don't okay. trust him. Wewe una trust bibi yako? Me I trust her 100%. Okay. So, Jibu bona na shanga kama hii relationship haina trust haina trust bona uh-huh. inaelekea wapi? Because I used to tra- tra- wait I used to trust you. So hapo umekuwa hypocrite all that time unadanganya uh, una ni trust ama nini? I'm still weighing lazima nikuwe na wei. So wewe una feel vibaya akikwambia she does not trust yeah, you. Of course because wewe stay na mtu mwenye am um, trust yani. Okay. Kabisa. Mimi okay. mm. anasijuni sema nini but mm-hmm. I have something. Mm-hmm. Let me show you. Mm. Ebu niambie hizi picha ni za nini. So ini huko ni kwa text message na si ndo hizi hata ndo hii hata picha this is my friend. Okay. This is my best friend. Okay. Unaona? So ebu na hii picha nilinitumia. Okay. Uli, so this is this is your man. Imagine ona hata ibu angalia hata kama unaona poa the same so, trousers ndio amevaa mm. sio kama unaona so, 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 so this this is your friend alikutumia picha ya bwana yako amekwambia hey. nini unaona <laughs> unaona vile amesema ati ebu see how your husband is messing up in the club mm-hmm. look hii picha ni nini mm. hii picha hata si ya kitambo hata one month jaisha a mm. a hii picha hata one month jaisha usifanye so, nani you huyo ni wewe sasa hii ni hii ni big deal kweli no is Wait, this you? is this woman next to you 
Mbona mna flat TV <laughs> So umeka CCTV baka kwa club anichunguze life yangu baka This is my friend yeah. and my friend parties. Hata sijai mwambia kuchunguze by the way. You can pass through all these texts. Hakuna mali nimei mwambia kuchunguze. Hata ukiangalia penye alianza kuniambia. Sikiza. So you you so there's an evidence here. Ah, uh, can you know hapo una believe? Why do you come let? Kama okay, that means there's another woman mm. unakaa na yeye kama unataka kuwa na you a woman. Unajua kila kitu So huyu Sheila, huyu Sheila ni best friend yako. Sheila, this this friend, this Sheila. Yes, she's my friend. She's your friend. Yeah. Wewe unamjua huyu best friend yeah, yake? Anamjua na pia mimi spend your and friendship yao na huyo msichana. Up mbele ya best yangu Nata. I imagine anamuona ama sijui akumuona hiyo club. Mtu kama hizi ni gani? Mimi I don't trust that your friend. Because she cares about me. So you Kukia Sheila me. in this picture alituma akakwambia I have seen your man yeah. at the club. Akatuma aka yeah, picha. Akanambia hebu angalia the other text look how he's messing up. Yeah, do, you you didn't ask him about this? Siku muuliza hmm. because the first thing Bono unaona unajua bwana siku kuuliza. It's not like this picture in a portray everything. Unaona hmm. there's just a woman next to you na kuna venye mna vibe na umemshika. Si angalia the picture here. There's no need niongea and there's evidence here. So mimi kuona hii picture siku feel like it's a big deal. Sasa hivi unafeel iko big deal sasa. Wait, wait, wait. Ukaanza pia ku behave so weird. Mbona like like so sasa time tunakaa na even in a month it's even mm. once or sasa, twice. Sasa let me ask you something because sasa umanipatia simu yako and here we usually we, we go through phones. The reason why nimekuuliza kama Sheila ni beshte yako it's because I can see some of your conversations here. If you will allow me na za nikataka tupitia. Is that okay? Through the conversations up we will see na issue. She's my best friend. <laughs> best friend. Ah, yeah. Apo umemwambia I have this issue in anisumbua can I trust you with certain information Sheila akakwambia yeah tell me what's the problem honey ukamwambia unajua tumekaa tume saizi for two years plus na sijapata mtoto yoyote and I have not had goja and I have not had any miscarriage eh? alafu ngoja ngoja that's not wait that's not my message you know na uh, 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 that's not my message by the way abusiza ebu fatia evidence vizuri pale that's not my message what you have said ngoja malizia conversation ngoja conversation endelea malizia so i'm trying to figure out could it be the campus abortion ndo imefanya nisipate mtoto ujaipata aa bebe hapana sikia unajua kuna wait sikiza kuna kitu kuna wait kuna kitu hamget hapa hivi seems fortile the whole story it's not like it's me ndio nilifanya hiyo abortion sume mention hapa hivi abortion so maybe that the reason unakata hata kuwezi pata ball here like abortion abortion kwa niyo ni nini amesia amesoma hapa hivi yeye mwenyewe ah usijishike Of course she learned best yangu. So why are you guys talking about uh, you you have been in a relationship for more than two years na hamjafanikiwa kupata mtoto na si ati umekuwa na miscarriage na si ati umekuwa pregnant unashuku ni kama it's because of the abortion that you did back in so campus. It uh, uh, it's okay. Dawa kumbe ni abortion in effect. Between us between sisi akuna, wawili si kitu ya kwenda public. No, 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 so like unataka uh, uh, Even our visitor hapa hivi asikie what happened. So hiyo ndio reason eh. Oh that time nilikuwa nafikiria ati ni madau na usinishike no don't touch me karo. Kwa hivyo bado utaki kuniana sana I'm trying to be polite na pia bado unakuwa mkali. Una play hapa hivi holy. Na see what hapa hivi. Okay, it's okay. That is something something. That is something you didn't know about. I didn't know about it. Baka na kuja kuya kuif. I think that's the only secret I have. Let me let let me now admit it. Uh, no, no, no. ni ni vivi unaibeba hivi hivi, right? Ah, uh, unaibeba hivi hivi, si ndio? Maybe that's the reason unaweza pata mtoto na unaniambia una, 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 hivyo tena. Sasa nini hii like imetokea pia ina story ya kupata mtoto hii? Abortion. Okay, it's not like as even the first one to do it. Very many people do it. So you imetokea hapa team mtu akifanya abortion ezi pata mtoto. Ni bad mother. This is about me and my husband. Ah, ah, See where we umesikia. Ah, 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 una, una. Hey. Let's talk about this issue once and for all basi. Sawa. 
you talk to me hebu nisikize yeah, nasema church girl ati una ati una nini so there some people things unafanya hapa hivi hapa nasikiza this okay i admit and i apologize so sawa that is something that you didn't want to share with your uliua usimwambie hivyo jess it's not okay Let me tell you let, let me explain. Ah, uh, uh, so let me explain. I was in campus. I was still feeling stupid. Ni vitu za kitambo. Yeah, Jesus will affect you in future. Ndio ina perfect hapa hivi. Na wewe wapi? Wesikiza. Ni kitu ya past. You also have your past. Unasikia? So si ni judge na past yako. Nimejileta yenyewe. I don't have any other past. And this is also my past hapa hivi. Okay. I'm planning to forgive you but ni kama ndio utaki forgiveness. Uh, 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 don't story. talk about forgiveness. You have your own party here by the way, yeah? So what are you trying to say? What are you trying to imply? <laughs> so let me ask you something Jesse, you and your wife because sasa Karo, you have to understand maybe imekuja sa shock. I didn't know ni kitu hamu kuko mmeongea kuhusu sindo. So ume open up to your friend, why didn't you want to open up to your mandom face your issue pamoja? Because he's too judgmental. Okay. Mhm. That's why siku taka kumwambia. Kuna vile me react. He's not even understanding. Yeah, that's why me I preferred I preferred my friend over him by the way. My friend is the best. So pia wewe umekuwa ki go through some personal issues. Though, though it's only the oh wait, it's only this one incident. By the way, trust me it has never happened. It has. Na ilikuwa juu ya it's a long story, you know na. Sitaki hata kuongelea like about it size because kuna venye it still hurts me, you know na. But who you hataki ku reason na? Mimi nanajonga the way anakuanga judgmental. That's why sijafikiria kwa. But trust me ningekwambia one of these days inge kwa like a like inge kwa secret forever ninge kuambia the problem is huyu anataka kuchukulia hiki kitu kama ni lightly hivi sana mm-hmm. ajaribu yani anajaribu ku wewe unajua kwa hii imekuja kwa affect our marriage yangu imeaffect our marriage unaweza sema hivyo umepata mtoto wait ni wewe mwenyewe umesema ah ah wait ni wewe you have a kid wait ni wewe mwenyewe umesema use contraceptives nani amesema ni me try imekataa hii ndio some of the things inafanya mtu easy pata ball alafu unasema hapa ija affect nini when she need to agree to kasema we want to have a baby we agreed this is the first year the second and the third year aujeka na mimi tukakuwa na hiyo discussion so how sure are you hindi the reason you had your own reason to come on huko unataka uko nini think what you want to think i'm not doing this anymore i'm not by the way because you're just like to na ni judge for no good reason because i feel like that is a, an in house kind of thing that you need to discuss with your husband sindo yeah so that's what tuka... i said tuonge na e, na amekataa kusikiza so kama amekataa na niebisha hivi mbele yenu hiyo ni nini that means we kikwa wawili he won't even listen to me uli ya bot we cannot assume at yondo imefanya ampati mtoto jesse ah, sahi nini tunaweza explain nini nini naweza explain so sasa because uh, nani yako hapa lile na kwa hapa na anasikiliza issues zenu Lilian wewe because you are here yeah, you are extra kisikiza what is happening between us acha ni vizuri amekuja at least ni kwa na mtoto come back come chukua then take her back i'm not taking her back i need the child because bibi naona hizi nini zinanionyesha hapa hivi jesse but let me let me ask you Lilian because you are here kwa kwa nini una smile because walikuwa wanajifanya perfect marriage sasa unaona shida yao. Walikuwa nikuuliza wewe juu umekuja hapa. Tunaweza tukaketi. Juu umekuja hapa kwa hii nyumba yao and you have disrupt everything, right? Because they are not okay right now. Mimi Kenya nilikuwa nataka ni mtoto wangu ashughulikie. Okay, na I'm sure atashughulikia mtoto wako because ajakatasi. Ajakatasi amesema atachunga mtoto. Wewe ukikuja hapa, are you in a relationship right now? Ah, hapana, si uko in a relationship. Sasa so, unataka iwakaje? So how you go in a relationship? Now, uh, because we are talking about uh, people and being in re- because at the end of the day if he's going to take care of the kid atataka kujua the men that are in your life sindo yes si hata wao unaweza kutaka kujua wana unajua mimi sasa hii kujipata in a situation yes. inajita in situation sasa hii kujipata in a situation okay. mimi so sasa what we usually do in this show we usually go through your phone okay so that we can check tuone kama maybe uko na mtu kama uko na watu maisha yako imekuwa aje ndo mtu mwingine hapa asifike ati sasa ako kwa maisha yako na mtoto alafu anakuwa surprised si ndio unaweza kunisaidia na simu i have nothing to hide mm. Ajita hapa perfect marriage. Look at you. Shida tu zenye zako. Unakuwa tu na shida zako. No, but You mean unaweza We, hebu handle story ya baby mama wako. Sana na mimi. Kwa call logs, ni kwa call logs angels like we usually do. 
Naona hapa hivi kuko na mtu ambaye anaitwa Jaden. Jaden ni huyo beshta yako sio? Yeah. He's my friend. Lazima hey. angenionyesha kwenye huyu jamaa anaishi. Unapigana okay. sana ama ni mara moja tu ame communicate. Ni kama mna yeye ndo ametokea tokea sana. Kuko na namba nyingine hapa ya Bridjo. Bridjo ni beshta yako? Eh yeah, ni bri... ni beshta yangu. Okay. Kuko na someone else ya called John. John ni nani? Ni mse tunafanya kazi na yeye. Okay. Mm, Western. Siko Western. <laughs> Niko huku. Na sitoki. Mtoto ni wako lazima umchunge. Ataniambia mwanangu unampigania. Ati Okay, so let's meet. Acha tuingie kwa hiyo ya let's meet. And oh, ni Jaden. Aha. So wewe na Jaden wao mna chat? Eh, yeah, ndio tunaongea. Mm. Lazima ningemchat nimuulize kwenye inga, inyangao ilikuwa. Usinite hivyo msichana. Wala iwe ni nyangao by the way. So, kuna hapa hivi conversation yako na Jaden inasema Jaden amekutexta na kuambia mbona unateseka hivi na vile baby daddy ako na pesa saa hii? Jaden anaongea hivyo. Yes. Uh, wewe ukamwambia wa uko uko sure na ndio nateseka hapa akakwambia ya yeah, aliingia kwa busy ya forex saa hii ako na do naweza ku help kama unadai anamaanisha nini akikwambia naweza ku help kama unadai alikuwa amesema kaa anaweza ni connect na na huyu ndio nimpata yeah. juali hama na yeah. change number ah, endelea na kusoma hiyo nataka kujua kumaanisha ku help aje azinaje ah. Lazima ngenisaidia kukutafuta. Sasa ningejua aje kwenye huyu. Kuongea mingi jua hata make sense. Wacha tusome kila kitu hapa. Lazima tunge communicate ni jua kwenye huko. Wao kamwambia what do you mean what do you mean in what way can you help? Akakwambia as in we can benefit the two of us. Nitakupea direction you go to place and I stay then you ask for the child's upkeep. Usilalishe kula do ya huyo mse ni beshte yangu na hebu saona unaoti alikuwa na mna mse alikuwa na hiyo hata hiyo hata hiyo hata ni njama yako ni kula fuck yani jaden jaden beshte yangu na unaweza wewe madam innocent speak hebu sasa kidogo speak now so wewe jaden alikuwa anakwambia ati usilalishe kula do ya huyo mse ni beshte yangu but alipata do akaanza kuringa Toto lazima achungwe. Achungwe na kunipangia njama na Jaden, si ndio? Yaani hata. Mbona unatetereka? Sasa si ongele lena juu liko na niongelesha na hapa ongea. Yaani Jaden my my childhood friend umnapanga naye njama, unataka kunikula do mimi. So wewe na Jaden mlikuwa na njama gani? Iko nini anakuambia mnaweza mka benefit nyinyi wawili kwa pesa za za Jesse? Obviously lazima ningemsaidia after nime nime nimepatana nime, um, nime na huyu. Umsaidie yeah. kunikula pesa. Ningefanya so, nini? Hizo ni nyatu umekuja hapa si story ya story na kiki hapa. Yeah, ni story juu yako unataka kuji benefit wewe pekee. Enyewe ni wewe ni ma... Mi una kai wewe. Sasa tu wewe Jaden na wewe nyinyi ni mabeshta wa aina gani? Ah, ah, yeah, that is better between me and her sasa. Who is better? So between mimi na yeye. Mimi ni mimi ni maipanga anytime kutake your money. No. But but ye yeah. unaona tu makosa yangu say good deal na yeye kabisa tuone so, so nikuuliza wewe for you for you and Jesse Jaden hapa kwa nini mnapanga kitu kama hiyo kuhusu beshta yake obvious alituacha bila pesa mm-hmm. <laughs> alikuwa na expect to survive aje mm. plus hata unasaidianga oh, Jaden sio kweli gani unasema wewe msichana wewe ukipata pesa unasaidianga maf- marafiki zake hata malize nini ndio issue yangu na Jaden it has nothing to do with this eh wewe unapanga njama unakuja kunataka kuni kwanza wewe unani lazima achungwe so ni pesa ya kuchunga mtoto ama ni pesa ya wewe na Jaden obvious obvious lazima ningeambia Jaden asante okay. umenisaidia mm, hebu kwanza kidogo because i want to, to, to continue reading something in your phone hapo amekwambia amesemeka hata ana kitu hebu kidogo hebu kidogo karo kuja hapa kidogo let me ask you something mtoto wako umesema ako wapi ana ako kwa mama nimpeleka kwa mama kwa mama yako wapi As long as I'm safe. 
Ah. So, because hapa sijui hata mama yake anakaa wapi. Hata sijui penye mtu huyu hapo. So sasa hapa kwa hii conversation yako na Jaden amekuwa umemwambia let's meet akasema sawa. I think mulipatana because conversation ikiendelea hapa mbele ana, unamwambia and take care of Kiki nitarudi jioni kabisa. So akakwambia it's okay alafu akakutumia love emoji na akakwambia don't forget our plan na usimuonyeshe umetense ukienda kwake. Juu atajua ni kama tume plan. So wewe na Jaden are you guys in a relationship na mtoto wako ako na Jaden? Uzi amesema Kiki yako kwa mama yake. Si umesema Kiki yako kwa mama yako? Kiki yako safe. Kwa hiyo mbata kwenye yako. Hata umso labda ni wa Jaden. I can sacrifice for that DNA test because from the beginning lalikuwa na sound nili suspect hata mtu hawezi kuwa wa huyu so mtu anaweza kuwa wa Jaden na itabidi umesema ukweli so wewe mtoto mtoto wako na Jessie ako kwa Jaden kwa nini kwa nini umemwambia ako kwa mama yako na ako kwa Jaden sahihi si atrista na muangalia na mpenga chakula wewe ulikuwa unampatia nini si ndio mtoni wako ona marafiki ndio kataza kutembea nao amekuwekea mtoto kwa nyumba na hezi kwambia penye mtoto wake penye mtoto wako wako nikikataza kutembea with such friends utaki kunisikiza mimi nakuongelesha sipi mimi unijibu karo wacha na mimi ni na wewe aje nikijaribu ku correct the friends utaki kunisikiza ah ni you two ladies have fucked up my life man fuck Sasa toka yeye uende nje yeye hata sitaki kuona yeye. Mtoto uchungi. Yeye mso lazima tuende DNA. Mtoto ni wapi? Lazima aende DNA. So wait, mbona umemgani anakaa na mtoto? Mbona mtoto ni wako? Mbona mtoto mwenye si wake? Who does that? Ah ah. Sasa natuchunga. Huyu alifanya nini? Si aliende na uka. Mbona na don't say. Kesha nadisha jua kila kitu tafadhali. Don't raise your voice at me. Sawa sawa. Na tumejua kila kitu. Anza toka nje uende wewe. Ah. Mira stacky. Gera ni msaidie kubeba bagi yake. So ngoja. So angels I think I'm going to cut it at that because clearly hapa hivi kuko na a very big issue but at least we may find out the truth that's been it from me and as always giving up should never be an option bye.